Hi everybody, Abby Inventing here. Today we're going to be doing a 1,169 star coin spree. So today is going to be like my birthday horse because I won't be able to buy any more star coins until after my birthday. So as we know, it's already May 18th and that means 14 days until I'm a 13. And this is probably Raven's second year that he's been with me. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. So right now we're looking at horses in more in um, Silverglade Manor. So I already have this horse right here. I named her already um, a Lucky Charm. I already have this one. This one is named Firefly. But I also have this one. I bought this one like a few months ago. His name is technically Smoke. Sorry about the background. My dad and my brother are talking. And I I really don't want another Ekoteki or a certain type of Adalzian. I think that's how you say it. But I really, really like the white one. And there are more places to go. And I really want to get a horse that resembles my real life horse. And I think this one's the closest. Well, technically my horse is way smaller than the one I'm riding now. Technically I had a thoroughbred and he is technically like this. But he had a star on his head. And his name was Raven. And my new horse that I have is smaller than this. He's like... His head is like the size right here. So let's go ahead and go check out more places where we can get new horses. So right now we're heading to Starshine Ranch. And also we're going to be looking at the new American Quarter Horses that just came out a few weeks ago, I believe. So since there was a um, double Star Queen Lincoln... I bought star coins so I can get me a new horse. So these are the brand new American Quarter Horses. Now I want one that looks exactly like my horse. So let's look at this one. This is the American Quarter Horse. I think it's a, it looks like a chocolate, but I don't, I'm not for certain. But it looks so cute. And over here we have like a gray buckskin. I do not like the legs for some reason. Give me a moment. Sorry guys, that was my dad. He technically told me to get my Optimus Prime sword out of the kitchen. So I do not like the stripes on the on the legs for some reason, but I do like the mane and the way they designed its face. So let's head on to the next horse. So this looks like a spotted white American Quarter with two white socks on the back. Now, I love it, but I don't want to get it. But we're going to see what choice I make. This is the Red Roan American Quarter Horse. She reminds me of a, of a filly that I was looking at in real life. So maybe not her. So this is the, is the bay, the brown bay. It looks like a um, red, uh, probably a light bay, but this is the same exact horse that, um, that, I forgot his name, but it's the same exact horse that he is riding all the way over there, if you don't see. And this is the black, the white on black American Quarter Horse. It's so cute, but I don't feel like I should get it. And over here we have the white and palomino color. So it it see I see it only has two or three socks. It has three socks and one that is not. So this is a a palomino, and this one I think is the closest to my actual horse because my horse actually has a line on his head. But instead, he only he has the same exact color and the same exact main color, but he does not have all four socks. 
because look, he has, my horse has all four socks instead of just two. Excuse me, I'm trying to do a video, but I really like this one and that Hoverman. I cannot get a Hoverman yet because I'm not at that exact level. So let's go ahead and head to Yovrick Stables. So guys, right now we're heading to Gerald Helm. Um, technically, they don't have a trailer to... Give me a moment. They don't have a trailer to Yovrick Stables. But I'm going to go to Gerald Helm to get to Yovrick Stables so we can see all the horses there. And probably after Yovrick Stables, I'm going to see in Figaro to see if they have any horses that are for sale. I know that there's a free horse, but I cannot find the exact quest before saving Annie. So, put it in the comment below, see how to help me. So right now, we're going to come over here with the snap strappers. I think that's what it's called. So these are technically, that's the American Quarter Horse. That's the one that I'm wanting to get. But... I know for certain. So, also, there's these snap strappers that came out like a few months ago. And I'm the most, the one I like the most is this one because I like the spots in the back instead of all around. And I also like this one. This one is a black on, a white on black. And technically, I just figured out that I already have a black horse and. The thing I do not like about the horse is how they were doing that pose. When they lift one, they do that. But technically, I like this one more. So, yeah. So right now, I'm going to go ahead and get back on Raven. Like you can see, like, well, mine is more of a silver color on Raven than that color. I really like the eye color. The eye color really suits that horse. So, I think there are more horses, I'm not for sure, but I heard that there are some horses behind the stables where the cows are at. Somewhere back here. So, as we see, we got the piggies, we got that race, we got this. I thought, I saw a video that there was more horses in the back, but I think that was in somewhere else. Sorry about the stomping, that was my brother passing by. Um, I think it's behind the stable over here. Oh, I need to get a haircut for Raven. Oh. So I'm probably gonna get Raven a haircut later. Um, okay, never mind, guys, there are no horses elsewhere. So if y'all saying I don't, I missed a part where I have to look of where the actual lead the horses are, just put it in the comment below. So right now we're probably going to head to Figaro. If they don't have any horses there, we're going to visit Veildale. And if there's no horses in Veildale I like, I'm going to go ahead and head to Fort Pinta and also where that new shopping stand is. So let's go ahead and head to Figaro. So now, guys, we are heading to Figaro Village. So now, since we're in Figaro Village, we can look for horses. I don't know if there's any horses here, but we're going to take a look. Like, I hadn't visited Fort Figaro in a long time. And there's a quest up that I'm not going to do today. I don't know why Raven keeps on running into stuff. So, there's a Clydesdale. That horse is cute. Um, so, we're going to check down here. There's a... Her oh, yep. There's actually a... Oh, there's a big giant selection. So... As, as we know, we have the curly horses. So let's start with this one. What is this? This is the North Swedish horse. And I don't really like Swedish horses that much. But I do like the curlies. I'm not getting this one. Now the one I really think of buying is this one. 
I did say I was going to get one that looks exactly like Elvis. Like, I think it's the same height. I think my horse is a little bit smaller. Hang on. We have to check. No, I think the, that horse is actually pretty tall. Like, it's the curly horse. And technically, Elvis's head is technically bigger than Raven's head. So if we look over here, I think these are Mustangs. Nope, they're American Quarter Horses. Oh, where am I going? So, next place we're heading to is probably Veildale, if we hadn't already checked there. Oh. Actually, no. Let's go to Fort Penta. I haven't been there in a long time. So, now since we're heading to Fort Penta, we're going to look out some look at some horses that are technically in Fort Benta and that um I think it's Nimmer's Highland no I forgot the name of it but we're going to go see other horses so here we are I think I can now buy the Clydesdale since I'm at level 12 or does it yep I can now buy it but and this one looks like Elvis off the actual movie of the movie of Free Rain that's where I got the horse of this name off of. So I see we have the Chickatendo Ponies or Chickatagu. I had this one before and I'm not sure I'm going to get another one because technically I don't ride almost all my horses. And here's a common era. Look, it looks so sad. Oh, no, not you. It looks so sad. This actually reminds me of another horse. And I already have this one right here. I named him Casper. And let's go ahead and go to the other shop. So guys, we are now at this um, Cornella, Cornella Windcopper. I think that's what it's called. Um, but there are a lot of horses here. That one looks like Elvis kind of, but it doesn't have spots. He doesn't have spots. I have this one. And I had this one until I sold her, and I really have this one because I can, I'm riding him right now. So, technically I don't like the switching because of for some reason. So technically they call these the Acle Takeys. And there are some new, I think this is a new horse. This is a Morgan. So I already know I'm not getting a Swedish horse. I'm not getting a Welsh pony, and I'm wondering. Let's go to get. A, let's go see the must. Scratch that, guys. We. I actually forgot about the common era. Whoa. Technically, the common era comes with a tax set that's going to expire probably in a few hours. I believe. I thought it said on maybe in a, on the 18th. I don't know, but these are the new, are the common eras. So technically, they come with a tack, and I really don't like common eras, but I like the tack. So technically, let's go ahead and go to the Mustangs. So guys, we are at the Wine Road, and these are probably Mustangs or American Painted Horses. So, I know over here, these are the Mustangs. This one kind of looks like Night Dust. This is technically a Mustang. And none of them actually look like my actual horse, which is sad. So, I think we came to a decision on my new horse. So, let's go ahead and make that decision right now. So guys, we are going to get a quarter horse, but we forgot, but I forgot what color I'm technically going to get. 
So technically, since my horse in real life is technically a coral horse, I think we're going to get this one. So let's go ahead and buy it, and we're going to figure out a name. So since his name is Elvis, I'm thinking we should go into the E's. So technically I don't see any sorts of L's inside beside the E. I think we should name him Extra. Is there any other E's inside this one? I think we should name him Is there any boy up here named boy? Yep. East boy. Dusty boy. There's a lot of names. I'm going to name him Little Boy. So guys, we got the new American Quarter Horse. And let's see how much money I have left until this page is done being loaded. So guys, I have 219 coins, so let's go ahead and go tack him up and take him for a ride. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you're new and have not done so already, please like and subscribe. And tell me which horse you like best, and tell me how much you like my horse. See y'all next time. Bye!